Two schools in Northeast Ohio that bring out the best in each other are Medina and Strongsville. No matter the sport, these schools have a deep passion for wanting to best the other. They are more than just spirited opponents. And the boys soccer teams clash tonight in a colossal tilt. It'll be rough. Huge, huge. It's been a rivalry for years, so. You know, my mom's from Strongsville, my dad's from Medina, so. It's funny, but uh, she definitely hurts from Medina. It's definitely a rivalry for sure. Uh, brings back memories from last year, you know. The PK that, uh, kind of a bad call in my opinion, the offsides call. It's definitely a rivalry between us. Heated rivalry. Two very good soccer teams that want desperately to beat each other every year. A rivalry and uh, definitely going to be a tough match and a dirty match. <laughs> Why do you say dirty? Dirty because, I mean, they're definitely our rivals and, I mean, every year it's always physical and just, it's brutal. Just another game. Another game we got to go out and win and do what we got to do. It's not a big rivalry to you? It's a rivalry, but, I mean, just got to keep our heads and play a game. The Bees jumped out to five wins in their first six games and just recently lost their first contest 2-1 to one to Brunswick. Still keeping up our streak is very important. We got, haven't lost yet, so we're not looking to lose. So far, I mean, definitely had some great team chemistry. <laughs> and, uh, I mean, we're, we're not the biggest team this year. Last year we were really big, but uh, this year we're definitely quick and we can definitely play technical. Senior Gareth Evanson's nine goals and six assists leads an explosive attack that's netted 29 goals in seven games. What's going to be a key to victory versus Strongsville? Definitely shutting down their key players. Um, just playing our game, no making stupid mistakes, you know. Um, playing tough is definitely going to be a, a chippy game and just keep our heads. Keeping our composure, not getting into like too many, like, well, hopefully not getting into any fights or anything. Keeping our blood pressure down, you know, just staying composed and playing our game, not theirs. Our defense, we only led in five goals so far this year, and uh, our forwards just need to keep on uh, uh, getting our chances and keep putting the ball in the back of the net. We've had a lot of good chances this year, and if we can finish our chances, I think we'll be fine. Good defense. Uh, definitely midfielders winning the balls. Uh, forwards putting the ball in the back of the net, staying composed. Our forwards. Forwards definitely stepping up and taking the lead out there. Definitely scoring goals for us, so it's not all in the defense. We've created chances this year, but haven't consistently finished. Uh, in some games, we've gotten a lot of chances and, and missed too many. Uh, against strong tool. We may not get as many as we've gotten in previous games, so the chances that we create, we need to finish. Give me a prediction. 2-1 Madonna. 2-1 Madonna. Prediction? I'm going to say 2-1 Madonna. 3-1 Medina. Medina 2-0.